y'all hey i hope everybody's feeling good and all that old shit anyway life's great pussy still good i love that line from gorilla Anyway, y'all know how i do it let's just jump right into it so I, i'm still on this subject because i did get a lot of footage um i did go to the sex expo but mind you this this expo is ran by caucasian and you know they did have some um some black people in the building and this is one person that I discovered. Actually, she was there on Saturday because I told you like Saturday was more of white night. So I didn't go there, but I did see this black woman. Um, she uh, she was talking about anal sex. I'm just not really, you know, it, 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 you, you know, when, when you know, you know, you know, and I already know and I don't even know. Like, and that's not something I'm really, really into like that. But anyway, um, but here's what she was doing. Okay, I'm at the Sex Expo, and this is this is uh, Pegging the Stallion, and um, she's beating ass for ten dollars. What, what, what are we doing? <laughs> she is not fucking playing. That would have been like, okay, it's time to ease up on that. You got, you got to rub on my ass after that. My ass has to be rubbed. She said, I know it's going to be extra. Hi, black girl love. Black girl magic. What the fuck you know about that shit? You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> So we gotta talk about this, like you know, insecurity, insecurity by by others, right? Anybody can be insecure, but let, let I want to talk about insecure when Caucasian women are insecure when it comes to black women. Now, mind you, I'm on my I'm on the train because you know I got my cars. You know I'm here. I went to the sex expo to 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 uh, network, so I got the the title of my book and all the information about my book, which is Quickie on the front, and um. And on the back, I'm writing down, you know, my website and my um, my social media social social media handles. So while I'm doing that, like I got my head down, I'm doing what I'm doing, and I can tell out of my peripheral, yo, it's this white bitch. She just like fl like just flinching and flinging her motherfucking hair. She kind of like sitting next to me, I guess, to try to get my attention or something, or. Uh, Show that her, because she got this long, straight hair, like, that shit means something to me. I don't give a fuck about that bitch, as you can see, ho. Like, you know what I'm saying? I, I rock my own motherfucking hair, ho. Um, and I know, like, at the, the media put, you know, uh, beauty on the, if your hair is straight and long. And, you know what I'm Bitch, I don't give a fuck about that. And also, black men do, too. I just recently heard some, this, what's that, Corey Holman, he was talking about him, and I'm going to talk about this at a later time, too, the girl Cynthia G, I don't know if y'all pay attention to her, she be talking about, uh, like, like, black man and all this other shit, and I'm going to get my opinion, but anyway, uh, he was on his show talking about her, and I guess she said, cause he was calling her, calling her a man, and I showed him he got makeup and a wig and all this other shit, and, which is true, but you know, she's on the show, so of course you're going to show up on your best self, but the straight hair, but whatever, uh, th that's another topic too. But then he said that she said something about his wife and she had a wig. And he was like, no, my wife is biracial. I guess that's her whiteness and her make her hair long. So like, as if that, you know, so everybody, even black men pay plays into that. Like that, that, that long hair, straight hair shit. And, and people really do, um, Focus on that shit and think that that's a part of beauty. But whatever you think beauty is, that is what it is. But also understand that this shit has also been planted in your head, people, on some real fucking shit. So I had an incident. So that's some shit I noticed on the train. You know, some insecure shit. I get that all the time with these white bitches. And then um, while I was at the expo, this Asian bitch, yo, listen to what this whole is. So look, check this out. Well, I was sitting right here, and um, I'm sitting at the edge, like right here, and this is the space right there. Why did this bitch come pull up and put her whole ass? Now, mind you, she got her whole her face is done. She got her lips done. Feel like she got her ass done. She ain't got yeah, like she got her ass done. She's some Asian chick. And what I'm telling y'all is that is that they do they do shit like that. Like when when a bitch is like not. Um, 
secure working they self. You know what I'm saying? I'm sitting here minding my business. You know what I'm saying? You know I'm doing it. This, you know, you know, all the black girls out here today doing it. I'll tell you that. Except that girl right there in the pink, I'm just saying. But uh, yeah, this was my little bitch. So I gave that bitch a little like, what the fuck? It's like, oh I'm sorry. Bitch, I know you sorry. That's obvious. But you gonna not put your ass in my face. 